Heather Hines here. Thank you for watching our third installment of Baking With. Today we are baking with Reds, and I'm joined here with Courtney Johnson. She mm -hmm. is the sales lead for the Miller Coors here in Indiana. Thank you for joining us. Yes, thank you so much for having me, Heather. I'm really excited today to talk a little bit about Red's Apple Ale as well as learn how to bake with it. Perfect, thanks for coming. Thank you. So the first item we used is our Red's Apple Ale. We used a apple cupcake with our caramel buttercream, a caramel glaze, and then little chops of apples on top. Um, this is so good, it tastes just like a caramel apple from the fair, so I absolutely love it. And uh, it's really easy to bake at home, so you guys should enjoy this. And what else can you tell us about the Red's Apple? Yeah, so Red's Apple Ale, um, for those of you that don't know, is brewed like a beer. It has a crisp, light, refreshing finish. Um, but then you're going to get that tart apple finish in the end as well. Um, so when we're baking, especially with sweets, uh, it pairs really well with it. So it pairs really well, contrasting that tart apple taste uh, with the sweetness of the caramel and the than buttercream. Definitely, that sounds great. So next we use our Red's Blueberry Ale. Um, this one we used our blueberry ale directly right into the batter. Um, I paired that with lemons. So we've got lemon zest and lemon juice in the bread and then we've also got a lemon glaze poured over the whole top. Um, it's amazing and <laughs> it is super easy. Both of these recipes you guys can do at home and share with the whole family because the um, alcohol content is added into the batter and then baked out. So. Um, any age group can have these. And um, yeah, it's so great. What can you tell us about the blueberry? Yeah, so Red's Blueberry Ale is part of our limited pick variety packs. Um, so this Red's Apple Ale is our traditional. And then throughout the year, we have some variety packs um, that are limited picks. Blueberry, raspberry, peach are all some of the flavors that we have. Uh, so specifically with the blueberry, um, when you're drinking the Red's Blueberry Ale, you're gonna get a really sweet blueberry aroma okay. and then that tart apple finish. Um, so when you're baking with it, it's the similar contrast with that, um, with the lemon tartness on top, as well as the blueberries mixed in. Definitely. Mm -hmm. Awesome. Well, thank you guys so much for joining. Uh, we're actually going to do a fun little thing at the end of this video, and if you guys have any suggestions or want to try any recipes with uh, alcohol incorporated into the recipes, um, if you use any other, other red varieties that she talked about, or any other wonderful loses that we sell here. Um, and post the recipe and a picture on Facebook and tag Monarch and Sweet Sisters and I will give you 20% off of your next cake order at Sweet Sisters Indy. Mm -hmm. So I hope you guys can do that and I uh, can't wait to see what you guys come up with. Thank you so much for joining us, Courtney. Yes, thank you, Heather. And you guys have a great day. Bye-bye.